Hey everybody, I'm going to be attempting to make grilled cheese. I haven't made it in about six months or so, but I'm going to uh, use mayonnaise instead of butter. That's what one of my patients did when uh, I was a home health date in New York. It's very good with the butter. So I'm going to, I mean not the butter, with the uh, mayonnaise. So I'm going to get the mayonnaise and the cheese from the fridge and do that. I'm going to turn this a bit, get on the stove, there we go. So we'll be off in a few moments. Just gonna get the cheese and the um, mayonnaise. I've made it with butter, and it's very good with butter. But I prefer I prefer butter, but it's very good with the mayonnaise as well. I always put three slices of cheese on it. I don't know why uh, I do three. That's what I've always done. I thank everyone for their patience while I'm making this. I just figured I'd try a little something different and do some cooking on video. It's 5.11. It's a little early for dinner. I had... um breakfast and lunch and I had cucumbers as a snack while I was watching one of my live streams and taking down the prayer request but I figured we have an early dinner now so I could finish um, crocheting uh, some scrunchies it's Sunday so I figured let it be a easy day let me trash this I've got laundry in the dryer and some laundry in the closet that I need to fold, but today is Sunday, so I'm going to take it easy. I got one scrunchie done, one just about done, and I'll probably start another. Today is scrunchie day. Getting a spoon to put the mayonnaise on. You don't have to put much on, uh, just a little bit on each side of the bread. I do just a spoonful. And then you just cook it as if you uh, were cooking with the butter. Uh, like I said, I like it with the with the butter and without. No, with butter and with um. Oh gosh, the mayonnaise. I mean, both ways are good. I'm not fussy. I eat pretty much anything. And we don't always have the food in the house that we want, but we always do have food. I'm grateful for food, a full belly, a roof over my head, plenty of yarn, and for my knitting and crocheting, um, plenty of fabric for anything I want to make out of fabric. Like I said, I'm not fussy. I know on my uh, supplies and my eating habits. And I was brought up to eat everything because there's so many people that don't have anything and I know people with food allergies have to be fussy but nobody in my family thank God has allergies so um you know, we're, we're lucky that way all my nieces and nephews fussy with their food uh, my nieces more than my nephews but uh I would say they eat you know, uh, pretty much uh not so much anything, but they like their pasta, their mac and cheese, uh, pizza bites, uh, what else, chicken nuggets, some frozen dinners. Um, they like uh, most of their foods that we make for the holidays, so no, we really can't complain. Let's get this so it's both on me and, yeah, that's better, it's both on me and the stove. an electric stove I probably should have started it a few seconds sooner but I don't want to take a chance burning the plate and um, I'm not sure what cheese my sister uh, we used a great value mayonnaise 
and it's the yellow American. I'm just not, I think it's craft that my sister uses, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm almost positive it's uh, craft uh, singles that she buys. I like the white uh, craft singles as well. I like also, what is it? I think it's Swiss cheese. It's got the holes in it. I'm going to turn it in a few seconds. I kind of got my channel. It's like a little homemakers type thing. Um, cooking. Uh, crafting. Nature walks. I don't know if I would be considered a homesteader or a prepper. I haven't canned anything yet. We don't have a garden yet. But, um... Let's see, this wasn't right. thought it was in wrong. Anyway. And here's what it looks like on the one side. Part of it came off, as you see, but that's fine. Not a big deal. Oh, I'm gonna go get the plate. Um, I used it earlier for the um, my cucumbers and sour cream, so I'm gonna get that plate so I'm not dirtying extra dishes. I'll be right back. And this is what I used earlier, so I'll just use this again. Just nothing. Uh, it's really not dirty. I started because I ate off of it, but not so dirty that I can't. Oh, this side came out a little burnt, but that's okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. Okay, it's off. Put that down. Uh, I gotta put everything away. Now, and the bread I used was some kind of um, Italian bread. Doesn't matter what type of bread you use, I guess. I guess it's whatever your preference is. Put away. The frying pan is cooling, so it's easy cleaning. And I'll show you this better at the table. Like I said, one sign burden a little bit, but that's fine. Not too bad. I'm going to sit this up against my polar pop cup. So I'm from Circle K. Polar Pop is just what they call the soda. I guess the soda. And I'll leave this here while I get a different drink. My sister buys these from Walmart. This one is mango flavor. Peach mango, and this one is wild strawberry. This is the one that's in my cup now. Let me put these back while I get my other drink that I want to have. Those little boxes, they come ten to a package. Um, you can get slightly larger packages, I think. Um, with, uh, 20 in them or 15, um, lemonade and I forget what other flavors. Oh gosh, I'm sorry, I was adjusting the placemat. Um, I forget where we got this drink from. Or if maybe a neighbor gave it to us. But, uh, we, I have this, this is the last can here that we got. We have like three or four of these. I guess I forgot where we got it from, maybe a neighbor. We do have a couple of other drinks there, which of one is like a coconut water, and the other one's not exactly an orange juice 
or um, what is it? It's not an orange juice or like a seltzer water, but it's like an orange something. Not sure yeah. what, but it doesn't matter. And here's the scrunchie I'm working on. Oops. I don't want to eat the crochet hook with my food. Here's the second scrunchie. First one is done. I'm probably going to make a couple more today. Um, I have these. I do have a bunch of black ones. Nice full thing of you know, uh, skein of your excuse me, skein of yarn. Um, excuse me. No, oh, I'm belching. Um, not sure what company it is. Uh, I was going through my stuff in this shed, putting it in um, you no know, see-through totes. A lot of my yarn don't have the labels on them. I mainly use um, Red Heart, but um, sometimes you get yarn that don't always have a label. Well, the label is beat up, so you take it off and trash it. Um, but, uh, that's about it, and I'm going to just chomp and relax and chomp away, and maybe if the YouTube doesn't cut me off, I will crochet a little bit on this video. I'm not sure. This will be considered a mukbang um, video. Be Hello, honey. No, you're not having any of my food. You got plenty of dog food in your bowl, my Bella baby. Go eat your own food, sweetheart. Okay? You gonna go eat? No, you can't have any of mine. We got too many of you pooches to share. If I share my sandwich, then I don't get any. There's too many of you. You wanna knit and crochet? Would you like to help me knit and crochet? No, you're not getting some of my sandwich, mama. Okay, sweetie, you're not getting any either. You dogs are spoiled. There's my fellow baby. There you are. You're in the video. You know you don't belong this close to the table. You know that, Mama. Don't look at the viewers or that puppy dog face. Yeah, you give everybody that cute puppy dog face. Yeah, get down. That's good. But this is mine. Thank you. I always thank Jesus for my food. Thank you, Jesus, for this food and drink and another day of life. And... Please help those that are less fortunate and lead us to the people that we can help. I know we can't reach everybody, but we could help those that we know about and those that you bring us, bring in our path or across our paths, whatever the correct saying may be. In Jesus' precious name I pray, amen. I like to pray before my food. I'm so grateful to have food in the house. Uh, we have running water, even though it's a well, and we're not fond of well water. We have electric. My sister has a car to get us around, to get what we need, get herself to and from work. Um, we have clean clothes. We have a washer and dryer. We don't have a dishwasher, but, you know, who cares? We wash the dishes. Hey, you're back again, my Bella baby. Now you're not getting any of my food. I'm sure it smells good. But your food is for you. I'm not going to ask for any of your doggy food. Yeah, you don't ask for people food, honey. Okay, I fetch you some more. You're spoiled. You're all spoiled. If the cows and the pigs from the field came in, along with the donkey and the mama donkey and baby donkey, I'm sure they'd be spoiled too. We love all of you. Where's your sister Stormy? Is she on the couch sleeping? Where's Stormy? You're Bella. Where's Stormy? Now, don't go looking at my plate. That's mine. Yeah, go have a good night. Go take a nap. I don't like giving them dog uh, people food too often. Because then they um, won't eat their food. So, I'd rather not if I don't have to. So, um, what's everybody doing for a Super Bowl Sunday? Feeding my clothes. No stormy, we're not getting any either. Here's my stormy warmy. Here's my stormy. Hi stormy baby and sweetie. Stormy. And you guys aren't getting any of my food. You can try all you want. 
and you leave the food on the table and these beagles, they knock the plate down. I don't know how many times I went to get my coffee from the microwave and the next thing I know, crash. I got the food on the floor, these crazy beagles. Oh, I see a lizard in the window. Another lizard in the house. That's okay. We love all of God's creatures. Oh, I don't love snakes, but... If a snake came crawling in, I'd be running out the door. I forget who my nephew said we're playing in the Super Bowl. I'm not watching watching it. Uh, I think it starts at 6.30 and it's only about 5.30 now. My nephews may be watching it. I'm not sure. Last year, my youngest sister had a Super Bowl party with a few friends. I don't think they watched it unless they watched it on their phones. Um, she had wings and cookies and, you know, some sodas and snacks. I took a walk and, uh, I passed by. She says, uh, you and the kids want anything? I, my, uh, the sister I live with was, um, is in the middle of me and the youngest. And, um, she had to go to work. I'm not sure where she, her boyfriend went to. Uh, she dropped him off somewhere. But anyway, um, I took some pigs in a blanket and some cookies. It was me, my two nieces, and my youngest niece's girlfriend. So we just had some pigs in a blanket, some cookies, and we, the kids, uh, the two little ones continued playing, and the big girl went back to her room, and just whatever it is teenagers do nowadays. So I'll get the door. I'll be right back. What's the matter? Okay, okay. I've been at two hours. May I finish my dinner, please? I'm being very rude to my viewers by walking away. Sorry about that. Kids are worse. The, no. The dogs are worse than the kids. More work. At least the kids they need anything from the refrigerator or uh, from the food or pantry. They uh, do it. You know, not do they, uh, they'll get what they need. The seven-year-old is obviously not old enough to cook herself. But she does do a little bit with the microwave with the supervision of myself or her mother. I know it's, uh, this Super Bowl, um... I don't understand football, so I don't care if I don't watch it or not. I understand hockey a little bit, basketball a little bit. Our dad was um, a big baseball fan, so baseball I understand. Uh, hockey and basketball aren't too bad, but football I never understood. A bunch of men throwing a ball around and then touching it and landing on it and I don't know. I just don't understand football. I enjoy the Olympics. The Olympics are good. I admire the, uh, oh gosh, <coughs> the, um, people who swim. I don't swim. I know a lot of people with the balancing beam and the pole and they're flying over the, the bar that's like five feet into the air. Um, I don't know much about that stuff, but it's nice to watch. I don't know what made me... Decide to want to 
video uh, myself cooking, but I figure why not? I'm not a major cook, but I will throw. Sorry, I have my mouth open at food. Um, and like I said, I'm not a major cook, but I will um, throw together a holiday meal if I have to. Uh, turkey and or ham, mac and cheese. Um, I make potato salad and macaroni salad that my grandmother liked. And the whipped and onion soup mix. I think it's in the soup aisle. I'm not sure. Or the, or the condiment aisle. It's two packets of onion soup mix. I um, make the potato recipe on the back of that. I brought it to church. They love it. Um, down here in Florida, I go to a Kingdom Hall. They seem to like it. Um, excuse me. I've been making it, oh gosh, maybe five years. That recipe, I don't know what got me started with it. I guess maybe we just needed a side dish and I figured I'd try it. Um, I take recipes off the foods that we buy. Um, I've tried a few here and there. We like them fine if we don't. Um, I don't make them again or I'll just make it at holiday time for those that do want it. I made three other videos today. Two were of my uh, goals for January. I didn't meet them all, but that's fine. And a couple of puppets that I finished for uh, Finish It Up February. Or Catch Up February, whatever you want to call it. Um, first time doing uh, Finish Up uh, February. Finish It Up February. First time I'm doing that. I do, I never got the uh, mermaid tail started for my niece's girlfriend. I was home alone all day today. My sister and the kids are still out. I probably should have got started on that today. But, um, i see what the uh, tomorrow brings. I do have to get it started since the mother helped me with some money to make sure I had enough yarn to um, get it. The one for my uh, niece's girlfriend, that is. And I don't want to break the kid's heart. I did promise it. To her, I wasn't expecting the mother to give me money. Uh, my sister and I were gonna get up, try and get up a few dollars to get a little more yarn to make sure I had enough yarn. It was nice of the mother to uh, throw us a couple of dollars towards yarn to make sure I had enough for her. I have enough for my niece's yarn. She likes uh, my niece likes Avery. She likes um, pretty much rainbow, like I do. Any kind of rainbow. I, mean, I got enough for hers. And her friend wants pink, purple, and blue in it. It's her favorite colors. Um, I'm hoping I have enough yarn to make her a unicorn on top of it. I have my niece Avery's unicorn. 90% made. I just got to make the horn and... The horn is something else. I forget. The horn that goes on the head. And there's something else I have to make for it. And then I can sew it together. What I don't like with that, it's... Not stuffed, you just sew each piece closed and it's, I believe, knit. I believe I knitted it, but you um, knit it, you close the open end, you sew the open end closed and then I got to sew it together. I, when I make something, I like it stuffed. I guess I could have stuffed it, but I didn't. I guess I got two more pieces to make and maybe the tail's the second piece, I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to make her friend... A unicorn as well. I I'm almost buy I'll have pink and purple left over, but if not, I'll just buy a small thing of each color pink, purple and blue and um just make a one out of it. If I have leftover yarn that's fine because leftovers uh you know in the way of yarn and fabric is always good for whatever projects. I'm just going to rinse my plate and I'll be back. I want to do some knitting while I'm making a everything video for my viewers.
cooking, eating, making a scrunchie. Heck, it's varied. Like I said, I'm trying to have a homemaker's type channel. I'll drink to that. Vixen baby, sitting on the couch all comfy. What's the matter, girly? Get more comfy, you good girl. Uh, she's in my other vi uh, videos, Vixen. And no, she's not one of Santa's reindeer theirs. For those that are curious. That baby, that's just the dryer shutting off. I washed them up, heads. Uh, been up since about, I don't know, 7 o'clock today. I got up. I usually don't get up to late 8.30 on Sunday, but I got up early. Um, my sister, that at her friend's house with the um, kids about three hours away, she sent a picture of a blanket that the woman had on her couch, and I said, I don't want to put the uh, video, um, I mean the picture on uh, Discord, the one of the group, Discord groups I belong to, and, um, <coughs> excuse me. And, uh, because the kids were in it, uh, it was my sister's two kids and one of her friend's kids. If it was just my two nieces, I would have put it on Discord. But because her friend's kid was in it, I didn't want to, I didn't feel comfortable putting it on Discord. So, um, she must have said something to the, her friend, the woman that she's visiting. And, uh, she said, oh yeah, my mom made it, I could get you the directions for it. So, that saves me the trouble of having to put it on Discord and see if anybody's got a pattern for it. I don't mind paying for patterns if I have to, but why pay for them if you don't have to? Uh, <coughs> my sister bought me a few paid patterns and a lady friend that I worship with got me a paid pattern. Um, I try not, those I don't give out because they're paid patterns. But as long as it's a pattern that's not paid for, that has to be pay paid for, I greatly would give the uh, pattern out. I don't care um, who I give it to, but I'm not going to give a pattern out that uh, my sister and my lady friend that I worship with had to lay money out for. Granted, they were only like 2 or $3 each, but you know, we had to pay for them, so everybody else should have to as well. I can't do tutorials on the patterns because... You need permission from the people that um, made them. There's a couple of people on YouTube that I uh, follow and... Oh, almost 29 minutes. YouTube usually cuts me off at 33 minutes and uh, 9 seconds or 33 minutes and 11 seconds. Um, but, um... <coughs> that was One of them had said... That as long as the book is, I think, 75 years old, they were allowed to read it because something about the copyright laws are off at that point. I don't know, so I can't say. Uh, I've got a couple of minutes before they cut me off. I'm going to be silent in a few moments while I work on this a little more. I don't have much more to go, just this little bit, see here, this is where I am now, and this is where I have to be, so there's not much more here in the middle left to do of it, but I guess I'm going to be silent for the last few minutes, and let us just all have some relaxed time.
I'm sorry, one more thing. Happy Sunday. Happy Super Bowl Sunday. Have a great rest of your day and weekend, everybody. Bye. About three minutes left. Bye. Oh my goodness. Oh, sorry from start, uh, creating a yawning effect. Fifteen to a package. <sighs>